What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Dennis Nderichu at the YouTube Basketball HQ, and uh, I'm back at it again with another video. This is the fourth game that happened between Union Sportive Monastiene and uh, oh my God, I'm trying to pronounce this game. This team, Genamir National de Basketball Club. Let's see what who these teams represent, which countries they're from. So this kid, this U.S. Monastir is from Tunisia, and uh, GNS GNBC, it represents Madagascar. And uh, yeah, let me just use their national. Let me just use their national names to call them for this scheduled broadcast. I just use Tunisia versus Madagascar. Right out of the gate, the Tunisian team out assisted this is a record breaking 35 assists in a game they set a new record for their assists oh my god this team was just pretty they just had a field day that this day yesterday in the game the blocks protected the paint the, the first team to to eclipse 100 points in a game and uh i'm supposed uh, I, I suppose i'm gonna see more more of these types of performances as we move forward because the game the games most of the games i've seen in maybe africa african games i rarely see 100 point games i only see like 90 92 point games 95 but this is pretty good 113 given the fact that that quarters are spaced like 10 minutes they only tell this way it's only 40 40 minutes a game not the standard 48 minutes that we see in the nba but they're able to score 100 points more 100 plus points which is pretty good and uh they beat they beat them emphatically and uh total rebounds i think this team just set the new record for both assists and rebounds because they recorded 47 rebounds uh my god these guys are just too dominant they're just too dominant no no answers the leading scorer in this team had 23 points they had one two three four five guys who scored double digits and one guy who scored 20 points or more as opposed to this other team this the team was bleeding there was only guy who was able to score 20 points or more but at this point they just had so many guys who okay how many guys go and scoreless one two three four guys went scoreless and only two guys scored double digits so goes to show you how outplayed these guys were in every aspect of the game except the fouls department the tunisian team was really flat out dominating assists this guy had eight assists another guy with six assists i mean this game was just theirs based on the points that they wrapped up the guys when them guys went to the line the Tunisian guys just went to the line made them free throws had a better free throw percentage they made every free throw they had so yeah man so the win was just in do ex in Tunisian fashion dominant fashion and um, yeah it's good to show you how prepared they were for the game and uh, they they weren't here to play around. They made a statement with this game, the first team I've seen in the BAL history to score more than 100 points, record 35 assists in a game, and a record-breaking 47 rebounds a game. And uh, let's see if some team, let's see if another team can top this stat up. But um, right now, in history, it has been cemented these guys are pretty dominant. Let's go to the short shot. Let's see what these guys did inside the court based on the shots they made and attempted. So you can see in the first period, these guys were really attacking the paint. They only made one three pointer. And uh, they really made their presence felt inside and they really blocked shots. So they're pretty good. Although they didn't compound many points in the arc, but they were hitting the mid-range jump shot, mid-range jumpers, and getting their presence felt inside. So, yeah, what works for you, what works for you. 
so you can see our you can see these guys made some couple of threes they made some threes down the stretch but uh, no many went in but the ones that went in counted but they made really wanted to make their presence felt inside the paint so they dominated inside the the paint and um, the Madagascar team just didn't have a chance didn't stand a chance in the third quarter in the third quarter you can see the same story these guys just flat out dominated inside the paint which if a team dominates inside the paint that shows you the other team just lacked any defensive anchors that could stop these easy points from getting in so yeah man it was just that it was just their game to take kudos to Tunisia they just came in and flat out dominated the same thing they capitalized inside the paint they just made sure that they made their presence felt inside the paint and they also shared the basketball and um, not much you can say there because this was just a spectacular performance I am yet I just want to see more performances like these because this is what excite this is what makes me excited when I see a, a game like this and uh, a game is just they're just flowing everything is just going so well for the team and uh, I feel I feel great I feel great about this great great win 113 to 66 blowout win in convincing fashion and uh, yeah great great game if you guys like the video like the video comment subscribe if you're new turn on the notification posts press the like button it really helps me out a turn and um, as always stay tuned and peace